go to usps.com click click and ship then sign in fill out the weight information of the package click continue now you just want to select what is the best size and price for you click continue after that fill out the information to process the payment and it's ready to go today's video we're going to be going over how to simply ship cold goods the first main thing you guys will need is a insulated shipping box and the next thing you will need is dry ice packs simply run these under water place them in the freezer for about 12 hours till they're nice and cold now simply all you're going to want to do open up a box your insulated shipping box then you see you will have this space here. We recommend placing one ice pack at the bottom, one or two. That way the base is cooled. Now you can insert anything that you wanna ship from meats to salsas as long as it fits. And then from there, you're gonna wanna place as many ice packs as they can fit in there just to make sure everything arrives nice and cold. So here you can place anywhere from six to, to eight ice packs in total. And after you feel happy with how many ice packs fit in there and you have everything packed and ready to go, simply put the top back on. Close the box and tape it up. And these ice packs last around anywhere from 48 to 72 hours. So we always recommend to make sure you ship priority when you ship cold goods, as sometimes there might be delays or issues in the shipping. So you just wanna make sure everything gets there as fast as possible. Now the options for the dry ice packs, you can find these on Amazon this 120 pack or this 36 pack depending on how many need how many you need and how many you want to ship